If this game didn't have enough, we had this wild sequence in the first half. That's Matt Ishbia, the owner of the Suns. You see the forearm shove, a little bit of an altercation. Grant, you just have to wonder now if there will be any ramifications from the league's perspective. We certainly hope not over the next couple of days. We want to see great players play, but yes, with a suspension, pushing a fan, something to think about if you're Denver. Jokic getting a quick two, eight seconds. Of course, the fan in that case happened to be the owner of the team. Will there be repercussions? We'll see. But I'll tell you, <laughs> Jokic putting on a performance, particularly in the second half, 53 points, 10 assists, only four rebounds. Twice we've had him where he's had his playoff career high. He had it in game four against Minnesota, ended in a loss, and having this performance here tonight, which will end in a loss as well. So getting off, scoring, having a great game on the offensive end, but Denver's at their best, and it's a collective effort, which they didn't get tonight. Quick two at the other end for Caldwell Pope. But Denver runs out of clock. The Phoenix Suns have picked themselves up off the mat. They've tied the series at two, and it's now a best of three as the party heads back to Denver. The Nuggets wasting a 53-point performance from Jokic.